Welcome to our introduction to algebra and in this video we'll discuss descending and ascending order. Now here we have two algebraic expressions. Now remember an algebraic expression is like a mathematic sentence. In a previous video I explained how you can count terms. So in our first example we can see that we have one, two, three, four terms. And that's the same in our second example. Now, there's a slight difference between the two examples. So let's look at the first one. We have 4x cubed, then negative 5x squared, plus 7x minus 6. If you look at the exponents, you would see it counts down from 3, 2, 1, and then no exponent at all. So because we are counting down the exponents, if we move from left to right, we say this expression is written in descending order. For descending order, we don't look at the coefficients or the signs between exponents. We simply look at the power of each exponent and we want to take it from the highest power down to the lowest power. Now in our second example, we would see our first term doesn't have x or x to the power of anything. Our second term has only 1x or x to the power of 1. And then it goes 2, 3. So we start with nothing. Then we have 1x, then 2x's and an x cubed. Now this is writing an algebraic expression in ascending order. Again, we are not concerned about the coefficients or the numbers of the constants. We are simply looking at the powers. 